Hi, I'm David Boyne, filmmaker and poet from Ghana, West Africa. Yes, Africa. I know you've heard so many things about Africa, mostly negative. Well, yes, some may be true, but you see, the real problem is not that they are not true, but it's just not the only truth. So to solve this problem, I started a production company with my business partner, Eric, called Beautiful Story Studios. So what if we took the microphone into our own hands and told our own stories? Instead of listening to what people say Africa or Africans are, we say who we are ourselves. A lot of people usually ask me what is the most defining moment of my career as a filmmaker. You typically expect my response to probably be, you know, about the brands that I've worked with. Well, while that is true, well, for me, I think the most defining moment of my career is being able to witness how much my work affects people way they feel and think about themselves. Um, for me, it's the idea of inspiring people to be proud of their heritage as Africans or to see the beauty in Africa. In one of my most recent works, Black is King for Beyonce, thousands of people reached out to me with a newfound hope. That is, I was in some way some source of inspiration for young Ghanaians and Africans like myself that Truly, regardless of where you find yourself, whether in Accra, in New York, in Lagos, your voice can be heard on a global stage. Two years ago, I collaborated with Tony Shikloni on a project titled Reframed, um, where we also came to Amsterdam for Tony's fair, and it was premiered. It was an amazing experience. But this year, we decided to take it a step further. We've seen documentaries about the chocolate industry, so we thought, what if we gave the microphone to the real producers of chocolate, the farmers? And so we made golden seeds. By then, I was in vocational school, I was in the police, but lack of money I was in the middle of my family. I was in the middle of my family, and I was in the middle of my family, and I was in the middle of my family.